I'm not buying anything, Kendall. <laughs> okay, picture this. The year is 1820. The setting is a small plantation in the Old Dominion where two black men shared something very special. What is it? It's a play that explores the question, could there have been same-sex attraction amongst the slaves? Take a look. You know, this may sound a little crazy, but it's like these voices, these people came to me. Some of these characters had a lot to say. Some of them didn't have so much to say, but what they had in common was that they were, I felt they were begging me to share their stories. Ivy League playwright Donald Jolly has dared to tell the story that no other playwright has told before, the story of same-sex attraction between two male slaves. Okay, I know I didn't choose to be gay. Who's to say that someone born 200, 300 years ago didn't experience those same things, even though they didn't have the language for it and it wasn't identity? It's just natural. Bonded is the story of the last remaining slaves on a crumbling, cash strapped Virginia farm. When Asa, a houseboy from New York, is brought down south to help in the fields, Repressed desires and memories of loss are all unlocked for the other slaves, especially Sonny. That's the gay storyline. Sonny and Asa develop a romance um, in a time and place where they were not allowed to have a romance um, and there's no words or no concept for understanding what it means for these two males to have this indescribable bond. The old man, he wasn't no nigger. My mother was not a nigger. She was African, like you and I. And if the idea of same-sex attraction among slaves is unthinkable for you, Donald says it could be that you're overlooking the obvious. If we're gonna say that Harriet Tubman was a human being, um, that Frederick Douglass was a human being, that Sonny, Lily, and Jack from Bonded were human beings, we have to recognize that they had human needs and a human need is love and passion and us gay people we are human so what was the human reaction to bonded i said african you is the negro what can be jack negro better learn to stay in your place you don't mess with no african Oh, I thought it was amazing. And I thought the acting was very well. I think the N-word was probably a little excessive. It was a beautiful, new, moving experience. So I'm still just still trying to digest it all. I'm not done with this play until there are larger audiences to see it. You know, I want to take this home to D.C., to the East Coast, um, to Atlanta, to Virginia. And I'd be really interested to know what audiences from these different places how they respond to it. What a fascinating concept in play. Unbelievable. If you want to know more about Donald Jolly and his play Bonded, click on the resources link on the No More Download website. Well, that's it for our show today. Here's what's coming up on our next show. On the next No More Download, it's our first wedding. Amen. No More Download goes behind the scenes as Ivan and Wyman jump the broom into holy matrimony. You don't want to miss it. All that and more on the next edition of our show. So, from the famous fashion district in downtown Los Angeles, reminding you to spread love and not hate, I'm Janora McDuffie. And I'm Kendall Hogan. We'll see you next time. All right. Ready well, to do some shopping? I'm ready to I'm finish ready to some do shopping. Some damage but up in here. You need to buy me something. Well, I got you. You got me. You don't me. even know I already got you something. Yeah. What when I was you out, got? I got you a new baseball cap. I don't want a baseball cap. <laughs>